Nokia N8 10 years anniversary celebration. First announced on 27th of April 2010, the Nokia N8 was the first device to run the Symbian 3 mobile operating system and it was the company's flagship device for the year. It was released on September 30, 2010 at the Nokia online store before it was released in the market. During its time, it is the first smartphone in the world to provide 5-band 3G support and it was also the first Symbian 3 powered device. It has an anodized aluminum casing in 5 different colors, a 3.5 inches resolution OLED display, a 720p video recording capability, a 12 megapixel camera with Car Zeus optics, an internal 16 gigabytes memory with support of micro SD card up to 32 gigabytes, a mini HDMI port, a micro USB port, it has an FM transmitter powered with 680 MHz processor along with a USB on the go so that you can use your flash drive anywhere you want. At the time, Nokia N8 had an official retail price of 23,699 Philippine Peso and if we are going to check it on the Philippine inflation calculator it will cost you at around 32,813.28 Peso for today's current price. disadvantages 1. Symbian 3 is still behind Android and iOS usability and standards 2. It has no video light 3. It has a limited third-party software and 4. Battery life is not that long But what makes the Nokia N8 interesting? The interesting part is that it has a 12 megapixel camera along with a Xenon flash and a loudspeaker. Let's check out the video and photo quality of the Nokia N8. Ten years ago, the Nokia N8 was its time far ahead. The picture quality was excellent with the 12 megapixel camera. In 
it has a mini HDMI so that you can watch your favorite movie to your big screen aside from the Bluetooth device it has an FM transmitter wherein you can broadcast your favorite music into FM frequencies So after 10 years, let's check the Nokia N8 if still worthy to be a smartphone device. So after connecting to the Wi-Fi, I was able to browse the YouTube using the web browser and also I was able to open my Facebook account. The sad thing is some apps like the Facebook app, the social app, the messenger apps, the Twitter and the YouTube app on my Nokia N8 are all not working but good thing is the web browser still works perfectly
and that's the Nokia N8. Thank you for watching. I hope you like this video. Please don't forget to subscribe and write your thoughts about the Nokia N8. Until next time. Bye.